low-calorie late-night treat. <laughs> Vinny is in the lead with 1,400 points. <laughs> this is obviously a game show, but a lot of people online thought it was supposed to be a talk show. <laughs> so we are appeasing those trolls. The <laughs> haters are our motivators. It's time for the talk show portion of the show. <laughs> Vinny, what's your favorite music album and why? That's an excellent question, Taylor. My favorite music album is Damn. And speaking of dams, <laughs> I'd like to talk about Lake Mead, which is rapidly desiccating <laughs> through the rampant agricultural water use. Uh, back to you, Taylor. Wow. <laughs> More points, because I've learned something else. Ricky, did you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? <laughs> No, but I did line dance to Achy Breaky Heart in gym class. Oh, yeah. Does that count? I mean, I think I remember it. Can you show it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's like, oh God, why did I say I remember it? So it's like, don't. Break my heart. Achy Breaky Heart. Tonight show in here. <laughs> and uh, finally, Rob, what's your contingency plan? <laughs> you mean for when it all goes down? <laughs> Thanks for that question, Taylor. Great question. I would say <laughs> underground bunker, obviously. Um, unfortunately, the guy that built ours uh, forgot to put it underground, so it's just going to be me and my family hanging out in my garage. <laughs> for doomsday. <laughs> Great job, panelists. Trolls, are you happy? Are you happy now? Okay, now let's play some games. In 2019, user Maple Cocaine tweeted something deeply profound. Each day on Twitter, there is one main character. The goal is to never be it. <laughs> A main character of the internet is someone that everyone online is talking about at the same time. And let's just say it's not always nice. Tonight, each of my panelists will become a legendary main character of the internet. It's a game we're calling Yes, That's Me. <laughs> For this game, I'll play each of you a video of someone who definitely deserves their fame. You will have to embody that character while fielding questions from the rest of us. If you give a convincing performance, I'll award you 200 points. Our first main character is for Vinny Thomas. This is who you are. The purest form of honey is honey with nothing added. So purest form of worship is worship yes. with nothing added. Yes. Vinny, what is worship? Well, first and foremost, worship is plain. <laughs> Feel me? Worship is a bagel with nothing on it. <laughs> worship is plain white rice. <laughs> Worship is not Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> Worship is Rice Krispies. <laughs> Strong. Strong start. And uh, tell me, what do you use to sweeten your chamomile tea? Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> to sweeten my chamomile tea, I use the purest form of honey, which is when I straight up squeeze a bee. <laughs> for Vinny? I mean, that's sort of how I feel about, like, Molly. You know, it should just be pure, you know? Which makes me wonder, like, do you know of any good raves in L.A.? Is that still a thing? No, brother. I don't rave. I want to have fun. I'll get together with a couple of my friends, male. <laughs> and we'll just wrestle. <laughs> in fellowship and faith. Sorry, I grew up in church. That was awesome. Um, we just wrestle in fellowship and faith. <laughs> Great work. Next up for Rob, embody this adorable hungry man at Luke Foods. 
All I'm gonna say is if you guys aren't using a ranch fountain, like, what are you even doing? <laughs> I'll start with a question. Uh, Rob, how do you keep your shirt so clean? Mm. Mm. Well, <laughs> that's a great question. Um, all I'm gonna say is, I've been hanging in my car for a long time. <laughs> uh, I had a lot of food in my car, so not a lot of other people like to get in this car <laughs> because it smells so much like food. <laughs> and basically, I just eat stuff off my shirt if it gets on my shirt. It's not a big deal. I feel, like, I feel like we might have to blur you sucking on your fingers. <laughs> I'm also realizing that I haven't washed my hands in days. <laughs> Does anyone uh, have any other follow-up questions for Rob? I have a question. What is Don't the... make me lick my fingers. Anymore. I won't. <laughs> what is the grossest liquid you've put in your fountain? <laughs> there are no gross human liquids. <laughs> One more question. No. Um, which of your fingers tastes the best? <laughs> Is it all of them? It's this one. <laughs> yeah. Well done. And finally, Ricky, this is who you are now. And tell me how to be sitting up there, feeling so high. Okay. Okay. And uh, I think uh, this might help your performance. <laughs> You're so welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Right. So, uh, it, seems, it seems like you're singing this deeply personal Halsey song to remind everyone that you still got it. Do you still got it? Taylor, I still got it. I write my own songs. Just to want to remind you that I sing, but I don't write. <laughs> I never write, and I don't play guitar either. I just sing on my couch. <laughs> and uh, is your family speaking to you after you posted this? <laughs> my family's not speaking to me, Taylor, because they want me to write my own song instead of hosting game shows. Oh, I mean, no offense. They want me to write my own song. Questions for Ricky? Uh, how do you respond to the allegations that you can't sing, you just open your mouth real wide? <laughs> Settle that. Rob? Please tell me 98 Degrees is getting back together. <laughs> comedic performers. <laughs> Time for commercials. When we get back, we're taking a trip down memory lane and uncovering past traumas that will make you stop talking to members of your family. Stay tuned! <laughs>